Hello neighbors, it's Brad here at eTrailer, and today we're taking a look at the Buyer's Product Double Ball Mount for two inch hitches. Now this ball mount features two welded on balls and you have two different sizes, one of them being two and five sixteenths and one of them being two inch. So that way, if you have two different trailers or tow a, a variety of different trailers, you're able to swap this over pretty easily and be able to swap ball sizes. Now the pin and clip is not included with this, so you are gonna wanna pick up a 5 8 pin and clip. Uh, locking one is a really nice option, and we have lots of available ones here at eTrailer, and that way you can leave your ball mount on the vehicle, lock that in place, and no one's gonna be able to just walk away with this. Now when swapping from two and five sixteenths ball to a two inch, pretty easy, take the pin and clip out, flip this over, put your pin and clip back in, and now you have your two inch ball ready to go. Now, something that you should note is the different ball sizes are gonna give you different weight capacities. And the two inch ball will give you a 7,500 gross trailer weight rating. And that's gonna be the weight of the trailer plus the accessories loaded on. And your two and five sixteenths ball is actually 10,000 pounds. So pretty heavy duty here. And speaking of heavy duty, this is a solid shank here. So it's pretty hefty. It's made out of carbon steel. It's also got the nice black powder coat finish even on the balls that are welded on here. So that's something that's nice. You don't have to worry about torquing down balls on your ball mount. You just plop this in, put your pin and clip in, and you're ready to go. Now you can see it's a straight shank, so there is no rise or drop associated with it. So something that you're gonna want to uh, take a look at is obviously the height of the hitch of your trailer as well as uh, the hitch of your vehicle. And that way you can make sure that your rise and drop makes sense. So this may or may not work for your configuration. Main thing is you wanna uh, take a look at the hitch rating, also what your trailer's rated at, and also which ball you're using, and compare all of those numbers and take the lowest of that. You don't wanna overload anything during your towing experience. Today we have this hooked up to an enclosed trailer with a two and five sixteenths coupler, and it's gonna work great for us. But if you have a different trailer that you need to hook up to, like a jet ski or boat trailer with the simple turn of the hitch, you're ready to hook up to a wide variety. And that was a look at the buyer's product double ball mount for two inch hitches.